Hi, thanks for clicking on the link. My name is Ryan Tignilia. I'm a criminal defense attorney in San Diego, California. And I can tell by the fact that you clicked on this particular link that you are in needs of a criminal defense attorney, which probably means you recently had a not very good day. Um, in my profession, people rarely contact me when everything's going well. And so you're probably uh, looking for some guidance on how to select an attorney, because if you're like most people, you have absolutely no experience with hiring a criminal defense attorney, don't know how much we cost, and don't even know what you're looking for, okay? So to that end, um, I'm gonna get, provide a little bit of guidance in how to select a, a defense attorney that's right for you. Uh, my first piece of advice is to make sure you are actually hiring a criminal defense lawyer. Um, it is its separate field of law, just like personal injury or medical malpractice or whatever, okay? So make sure you're hiring an actual criminal lawyer that has experience in the criminal courts. Um, some lawyers, unfortunately, view criminal cases as free money, and they'll take them even though they don't really know what they're doing, because the criminal justice system is, is a wheel. It turns, okay? The judge is going to be there, and the prosecutor is going to be there, and offer is going to be made, and the system will grind you out regardless of how good your attorney is. It just means that you're going to go along with whatever the prosecutor and the judge wants, where your attorney really isn't doing anything other than relaying messages to you, which is not what you hire an attorney for. So make sure when you hire an, an attorney that they're actually a criminal defense attorney. Uh, second, once you've determined they are a criminal defense attorney, make sure they're a good one. And the way you do that is you ask them about whether or not they've taken cases like yours. Um, while we don't have specializations in California, um, there are attorneys that focus more on one type of case than another, right? Some attorneys, they might focus on DUIs and they don't want serious criminal offenses. There are other attorneys that are the, are the polar opposite. They want the serious offenses and don't like the misdemeanor cases. So ask them what types of cases they handle, have they handled cases similar to yours, and you know, have they gotten the outcomes that you're kind of hoping for? We're not allowed to guarantee you a result which actually is piece of advice number three. It is not at all uncommon for someone to sit down with me and say, hey, if you promise me I can keep my license, I'll give you all your money right now. If anybody agrees to that, do not hire that person. The, the rules of professional responsibility are very clear that we're not about to do that. Instead, inquire about whether they've had handled cases similar to yours and what the results of those cases were and how close those results are to what you're hoping for. Um, finally, and this is gonna sound a little cliche and amorphous, but make sure you hire an attorney that you're comfortable with. Um, communication in criminal cases is extremely important. You want someone that you know and that you feel comfortable has your best interests in mind and is working hard and working diligently to get you results that you have made them aware of and that they have understood and are focused on getting. Okay, if you'd like to talk to me about that, you can leave a comment in the comments section or you can call me at 619-577-577. 0868. Thank you very much.